From Wood TV 8, this is a breaking news alert. Breaking now, the Kent County homeowner who shot and killed a burglary suspect says that suspect fired several shots before he was killed. The shooting happened shortly after midnight on 108th Street near Wilson Avenue. That's near the Kent and Allegan County line. News 8's Joe LaFergie spoke with that homeowner and is live for us. And Joe, what did he have to say? Yeah, Emily, Tom, uh, this is the home we're talking about here on 108th in southwest Kent County. Al Leonard is a homeowner here. Uh, he left just a short time ago, but he tells me just a short time ago uh, he heard a noise out in his driveway and found a suspect trying to break into his pickup truck as it sat in that driveway. Again, this happening just right around midnight. He confronted the suspect from his front door, told him to leave. The suspect didn't leave. Leonard then went in the house and called 911, also made it to a locked cabinet that had a hunting rifle in it. The suspect at the same time was breaking into another door at the home here, making his way into the house. Leonard grabbed that gun, called 911 again, and told the suspect he was armed and told him to leave. Well, that's when Leonard says he began to fear for he and his family's safety. The gentleman was out here at my pickup truck, knocking the windows out of it. We yelled at him to go away. He proceeded to advance on us. We shut the door, locked him out, called 911. I loaded my deer hunting gun and just stayed inside. And then he went through my back door and approached us up the back steps. I told him to go away. I have a gun on you. And he would not go away and kept advancing on us. Then he started shooting at me. And well, it's going past your head like that. <laughs> and I took cover and. Obviously, a, a very, very tough situation for Leonard. I asked him how he was doing. He says he's uh, obviously quite shaken up over all of this. As for that suspect, we have not, the Sheriff's Department hasn't released a name yet. We do know he is a 39 year old man from the Middleville area. He has also been connected to at least two other vehicle thefts here in the same area prior to last night's shooting. Live in southwest Kent County, Joe Lafergie, News 8.